Look at you and your little fuzzy hat. Looks comfy. I wish I had one. Oh, that'd be so, that'd be so cool if you could do that. If you could have, like, hats for Kratos and stuff. Ain't going nowhere without this. What? Sure. Where would you mug spouts even be without me? Oh. What is it you expect to need Kratos for, Highness? Clearly you've been quite capable of breaking Odin's curses on your own. The other curses grew weak from Thimble Winter, but I still needed help to break them. This one is held strong. So all that trying to kill him, that's just your goddessy way of asking for help? I don't recall asking you to come along. Because <laughs> you did. I got an old drinking buddy I've been meaning to look up once this joint was out on the map. Got a hunch lending you folks a hand's gonna keep me up where I go. And what makes you think that? Cause last I heard tell, she was running with that beef with brother of yours. Freyr is not a part of this. Well, my hunch says otherwise. Scroll huh. too. I can feel the pool of the binding curse. Its source is further in. Follow me. Okie dokie. Muggier than a Mufelheim shit pit out here. I'm nearly as fragrant. Suppose Fimble Winter's to blame. But if it helps these two find peace. This is a temporary alliance, Mimir. Anything beyond that would require trust. Oh, please. You know damn well Kratos isn't the true cause of your suffering. You're both as oh, yeah. much a part. Huh. Oh, no. Something's wrong. My spell, I can feel it slipping. Well, that's Fimble Winter for you. You don't understand. I'll be torn from the realm. What can be done? Something I was hoping to avoid. <sighs> Seems I don't have much... Falky! <sighs> Come okay. on, then. You had a way around Odin's curse this whole time. No. I discovered it once you unlocked realm travel. And it solves very little. This form is extremely limiting. Hey, uh, how's about a riddle? Take your mind off. I'm in. What no... runs with no legs? Easy, a nose. You'll have to try harder than that, bro. Just you. Fuckle. Watch where you're going. <gasps> the plants are extra aggressive in this humidity. Anyway, <gasps> what I was trying to say before they. Never stopped talking. That looks interesting. Um, was that this? This episode is uh, is another re-record. Um, so uh, I'll, I'll, I'll I'll just be going through this fairly quickly, just as so I can keep my sanity of having to re-record like four hours worth of footage. Forgot how much I like scrapping dirty. Uh, however, I don't actually remember how I get up here. I think I just go all the way around. Where has everyone gone, I wonder? They must have withdrawn, hidden themselves out in the wilds, and covered their tracks with magic. No way of knowing how many are left or how to reach them. Aesir ran top shot all over this place, huh? You can thank Mimir for that. War with the Vanir was never my idea. My idea was brokering the marriage to end it. A great success that was. Obviously, the peace was no less a disaster than the marriage. Did he? Oh, what the hell? Jesus Christ. Ah, you! Yeah, hit me already. Yeah, I'm, I'm not, you know, I'm not gonna bother with my uh, chests and my blue and everything. Um, because when I when I hop back over to my uh, my other save, where I've actually completed the game and everything, I'm, I'm gonna have it all back anyway, so... Being here again, bringing back memories of that wedding of yours. 
fancy folks in quality meats. And though I remember your brother stirring up an awful scene. Why do you keep bringing him up? My brother is no concern of yours. Hey! The plant life grows more dangerous the further we go. Hope you're up for it, dwarf. <laughs> Listen, I know how bad it can get with one zone. So Sindri and I were on the out so long, it was like not having a brother at all. Now I take some of the fall for that on account of me walking out. But it never stopped me blaming him most. Any of this oh. sound familiar so far? And what is your point? My point is, that weren't the end all of things after all. Once we got our heads right, it was like no time had passed. He went straight. Wolvers, everyone shut your gobs! One of them carry it! Worth it. You don't got what it Got another one joining the party! Look alive! Now! Closing in behind Jesus Christ, piss off! I'm Maybe the worst word said between you don't have to be the last one said. Hold up! If you want to keep your insides inside. Yeah. All yours, big guy. Your people not receiving visitors? I wouldn't know. They're not my people anymore. <laughs> Bet you're glad old Brock's around to save you. Uh-oh. Yeah! <laughs> we should probably go get him. Yeah, Keep you think? Send another god to do his dirty work. Thor too busy. We do not serve Odin. <laughs> no? Picked a dangerous place for sightseeing then. All right. No, no. No need for threats, brother. Oh, I know that voice. <laughs> you know, I'd cut off your head, but it seems somebody beat me to it. Aye. Oh, quite observant, brother. <laughs> no, you're no brother of mine. He sold my sister to that prick. We broke it a piece. Oh. Did you now? Where is it? Hmm? And where is my sister? 
Some dungeon in Asgard? Is she even alive? Answer me! I guess we'll settle for blood. Stop! What is that? Why do you speak in her voice? It's me, Ingvi. There's no time to explain, just listen. These men are in my service. I'm here to reclaim what's been taken from me. It's too late. You can't undo what's been done. I can. I will. Now let them pass. So... You serve my sister. Oh. Oh. Don't we all? Put him down. What's with leaving me hanging like that, you crusty hag? Come here. Well, found who I was looking for. Think I'm gonna stay and catch up. Oh, are you now? Do as you wish. Brother, if you wouldn't mind, I'd have a word with Lord Freyr. I'm trying. Sorry we got off on the wrong foot there, stranger. We're pretty used to only seeing Aesir in these parts. Don't typically get friendly faces. That... That is a friendly face, yeah. His name is Kratos, and no, the Aesir are in Vanaheim. <laughs> yeah, we've been occupied since... Yeah, I lost count. What is your plan? You still kind of working on it. Mm -hmm. Brother, I think I could be of use here. If my counsel is welcome. Well, I'll take what I can get. <laughs> your mission will go considerably smoother without me in the mix. Come back for me when you're done. So don't tell me. Oh, okay, well, then you can help me at the forge. Okie dokie. Hey, Kratos. Yo. As long as you're working for my sister, carefully you don't screw up. Just yep. too big on forgiveness. Bit late for that one. Now that the distractions are out of the way. I have words if you would hear them. Speak them. With anger you feel for your brother. I know it well. You have a brother? His name was Demos. When we were boys, he was taken by two gods obsessed with prophecy. The gods of my homeland seldom left survivors, so by the time I learned he had lived, it was too late for amends. His anger poisoned him against me, but I never stopped loving my brother. You think my anger is irrational? You've known Freya for mere moments, and already you're taking his side? I am not taking his... No. You're just sharing your thoughts on a subject you know nothing about. Cap, but all right. An ancient. What's up, dude? <gasps> hey, I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. That was a great throw, bro. Shut up, bitch. Hey, 
I know what you're doing. Trying to play on my sympathies in the hope I let you live. I am only trying to help. The mistakes of the past need not be repeated. I don't need to hear about your mistakes. I've made enough of my own, thank Everyone is so eager to advise me. As if any of you know me or what I need. The biggest loss in my life is due to you saving me when I specifically told you not to. Well, it was my family. My mess. I know Baldur wasn't perfect, but he was mine. I know. You know? You think you can even begin to understand the pain of losing a child? Yes. I do. There was another. Ow! Yes, there was. <laughs> you piece of shit. Her name was Calliope. Calliope? What happened? It was long ago. Never mind. <laughs> You were so close. Oh, you're up there. Can you not just fuck off for a single second? Yeah. <laughs> 
Much better than last time. Jesus. We need to get to that watchtower. We'll have to go through the valley this way. I know your son's story. You should know my daughter's. In the service of a cruel god, I was tricked into destroying a village, not knowing my own wife and child were there until their blood stained my hands. I swore revenge. That's... I can't imagine. I paid back their blood a thousand times and burned Olympus to the ground. Yet, the guilt remained. Perhaps you will kill me, Freya. But it will bring you no peace. Perhaps it is not peace I seek. All those times I found you. Why'd you refuse to fight me? Every outcome would mean defeat. What does that mean? I have never wished you harm, Freya. You helped us. You saved Atreus when he was sick. I did not wish to live with killing you any more than I wished to die. I see. Noken! And so close to the village! Their song makes their allies invulnerable. They will not let you pass unless you destroy them all! Yeah. My village. I hardly recognize it. I used to play hide and seek with friends. We'd spend afternoons stealing honey bread from the Grand Hall. At harvest honey time, we'd dance and feast until the sun rose. It was all so simple. Why did I have to come back here? And be reminded of all this. The Grand Hall. It's in ruin. Ah! <laughs> 
enough what Odin did to me. So many people. You have a home to remember fondly. In Sparta, we were taken from our homes as children and raised in your home. We marched when we drowned. We fought for scraps or starved. Our elders beat us till we could not stand. At night, we made our way home. Alone. Or were food for wolves. That is how Spartans are made. Well, considering how Spartans are made, it's no wonder you turned out as you did. Your fate was sealed from the start. Fate can be overcome. I used to think so. When the Norns told me of my son's fate, I thought I could change it. You know well how that worked out. The Norns. The fates of these lands. That's right. You defy prophecy at your own peril. Patrix would agree with you about prophecy. He rushes blindly to a fate the giants foretold. He disappears for two days, trying to prove he is their champion, fabled to fight at Ragnarok. What? I know all the Ragnarok prophecies. There's no champion of the giants. It is one glow concealed. Because of this champion, the realms are saved at Ragnarok. Only Asgard falls, and Odin with it. So all this time... Odin's obsession with every detail of Ragnarok, he's been missing a crucial piece. Huh. Well done, Groma. Atreus will yeah. not be a pawn of prophecy. You still stand against fate, even with victory foretold. I will not march my son to war. He is no Spartan. I would keep it that way. You would speak to me of protecting your child? Is my yes. tragedy not <laughs> enough of a reason? Finding fate is a waste of the precious time we're given to spend with them. Oh crap, wait, no, go back. Oh wait, no, come back again. Can you swing that torch to the other side and burn the bramble blocking your path? What I'm gonna do. Oh, right, no, come on. Pull it backwards. There we go. Let's cross the bridge now. of anyone alive be squeamish about war after all the gods you've killed I have seen enough war to know the cost and I don't after the price I paid to end one look around you Kratos see what happens when you don't fight a true evil that's one of Odin's captains I am ready <laughs> Ouch. Okay then.
で。イージペイジェラグラクナクリンバクウチュウロスティニモアヴィンキーゲスイエムリーチングマイリミットフォーエンライトンプラティツフォーユーテデイケンユープリーズジャッシュアップエンキルフィンズジェイズアムソリ Calm down. Do not tell me to kill again. What? I kill to protect my son, to aid my friends. But I will be no one's monster. Never again. You don't get to make that choice. Not with the debt you owe me. I am not here for debts. I would always have helped you. So much has been taken from me, and I'm just supposed to let it all go? Freya. Enough. <laughs> There. I feel the source of the magic keeping me in Midgard. What is this place? My home. I was born here. Hold on. Something's not right. Opin Bera. World tree roots bound in Odin's damn knots. That's how he did it. Come. l i z a r d Nico! Creature! Is it belongs to Odin? No! It protects i g r i s i l s roots wherever they are! The bastard was counting on it! Yes, 
<laughs> so cool. Get down, pussy. Your axe, aim for my sigil. There we go. Yes, bring nice. I have to 
break his hold on me, then you are in the way! Last song, Rainfall! God damn! Read that scene in the uh, Endgame <laughs> where that dude gets his hand chopped off by Doctor Strange. It's over. It's, it's really over. And now that you have what you seek, I suppose this is the point where I forgive you, where I kill you. To be honest, I don't think I can do either. There's still a part of me that is so angry that it'll always be, it'll always be angry. But no. You are not the one who needs to die. I do see that. Look. Everything that's happened between us. No need to explain. Not to me. Not for that. I do not regret saving your life, and never will. But the choice between life and death should have been yours to make. I should not have robbed you of that choice.
What's that? Oh yeah, the amulet. Oh, this is where it comes from. Awesome. Now that I am myself again, I suppose it's time to face my brother. And after that? I don't know. It's been a long time since I've had a choice. Let me live with that. Okay. We can take this way back to the camp. I can help with the vines. Yeah, do it. That one said you Fast learner. <laughs> your brother seemed open to your return. Oh, I'm sure he'd love nothing more than for everything to go back to how it was. Leaving the I know, I know. Jesus, hello. Rot! Regards. <laughs> use your anger effectively. Well, you learn to use what you have. It's not as though I want to be angry with Freya. He's my brother. He was the most important person in the world to me for half my life. These plans, the, now the sigil should hold the frog. Well done. Watch out, hold the whip. Powerful manifestations of runic magic. Dope. Could I ever think of this place as home again? After all that's happened. Wait. Skull and Hadi are in Vanaheim? We learned the giants rescued them from Odin and brought them here. And look, the sunlight wakes the sleeping roots. See how they stretch to welcome the sun? Beautiful, no? A far cry from the sheets of Midgard snow I've grown accustomed to. The Eastern Migration, it's just as I remember it. At least the whole realm hasn't fallen to predators and occupiers. I guess there's still something to be fought for here. Something to defend even after so much damage has been done. Maybe that goes for Freyr. Yeah. yeah. Anaheim is a really pretty place. My sigils can break through their shields! They're defenseless now! I did not 
Easy source. So much has happened since I last saw Freyr. I'm not even sure where to begin. What do you want from him? An apology would be a start. I want to forgive him. I'd like to think he's changed. He's all I have left now. Did you ever apologize to Demos? It is difficult to seek forgiveness when you feel unworthy. Now how to get across? I know. My sigil arrow should be able to carry the fire across the river to reach the bramble. I fucking hated this part. It's so difficult just to hit the fucking thing. Forgiveness can be powerful, even for the unworthy. My wife Faye taught me that. Hmm. Well, Move. Be there glad we go. you have a spouse to remember. Good point. <laughs> Damn it. It avoids every attack. Okay. Oh. All my former spouse taught me was that there's no limit to the depth to which a soul can sink into darkness. Tricked me into marriage to spare my home and took my home just the same. Scattered my people to the wind. Maybe it's time somebody drew the line. Maybe it's time someone makes Groa's prophecy come true. I will not wish for war, Freya. War is a terrible thing, Kratos. But some things are even worse. You know, she has a point. Atreus rushes to Ragnarok. You may not be able to stop it. I will. And if you fail? I have prepared him to survive without me. If he must. Yeah, that is true. We. This so way. So what's next for you, if not preparing for war? I do not know, but I will take no chances with Atreus. Well, you may want to think fast, unless you want someone to make that choice for you. Shush. Ready. If I can't teach you parenting, you can't say you can't say shit to me about parenting. <laughs> no. It really is you. <laughs> you returned to us at last. Yes. Uh, let's celebrate. You reclaim the throne, we'll rebuild, me and you against the world. Huh? Just like the old days. I'm... not staying. I don't understand. You're here. 
Maybe together we can take back what's ours. I only just got back what's mine. I still have work to do. You've seen what's left of the realm, right? Do we really mean that little to you? You question my loyalty? Vanaheim turned its back on me. Oh, you still can't let go of that old fight. It was my duty to save as many of our people as possible. My responsibility. One you didn't take seriously then, and from the looks of it, one you don't now. You think this is a game to me? Yeah. <sighs> we lost everything to that maniac you called husband. The man's family set me on fire. How did you expect me to react? Like my brother. Like the boy that used to have my back no matter what. And who I always supported no matter how selfish his choices. <sighs> I expected you to come and find me. That no matter how hurt or angry, you wouldn't abandon me. Freya, please. I... I thought you were dead. No. I've had to live lifetimes with those last awful words I said to you. Have any idea what that's like? Knowing that your own selfishness hurt the person that you cared about the most. Abandon you. Oh, Freya. I mourned you. Oh, I've missed you so much. And I, you, Evie. But I won't bind myself to another realm when I finally have my freedom. I'll send help, though. And I will come back. I promise. This hasn't been your home for a long time, has it? Do what you gotta do. All right, all right, that's enough. Ain't y'all got nothing better to do than gawking at family sorting squabbles? Come on, you two. Not you. Got a few things to square with y'all. First is you collecting your spare head. Second is that sigil magic I smell on your bow. <laughs> and that's an idea I'll steal. How's about I set you up with some sonic mojo? Call it a trade. Very well. Third of all, if you ain't staying here, bears mentioning that Sindri and I find ourselves running a flop house for unemployed gods. If you're done freezing your backside off in Midgard, maybe come back with Beardo there. Check up on your old pal Tyr. That's kind of you, Brock. I may do just that. Well, all right then. I'll meet y'all back at the house. Unless you right. want me to fix anything up first. Well, brother, here to meet our new allies. Or shall we depart? I want to leave. Can we leave? Let's leave. Okay. I'm going to end this episode here then. So, as always, if you enjoyed, hit the like button, leave a comment. Let me know if you enjoyed the episode. Um, I continue to re record episodes. 
Uh, I think I only have a couple left. I really hope I only have a couple left. Um, but we'll find out. So, I will see you all in the next episode. Toodaloo, buckaroos.